is my pleasure today to have some Central High School choir students. Welcome. Hello. And you all are all in the show choir at Central, which yes. is somewhat of a new concept under this our new fairly new director. And you all, let, let me introduce you first. Uh, Olivia Knickerbocker is a senior and going to ASU and going to still do some music. Yes, ma'am. Okay, excellent. Alicia Cornwell is a junior, going to be with us another year, so that's excellent. And Nicholas Dietrich is a 10th grader. and. Yes, our two at that end of the couch will be the leaders for next year. Yes, ma'am. And totally in charge is my <laughs> estimate. And Caleb Rawson is a senior as well, going to ASU, and a, somewhat of a newcomer to San Angelo compared to your uh, peers here. Um, our two on the far right end have uh, grown up here, and uh, uh, Olivia came and it's been here quite some time. Yes, ma'am. So you all are in a show choir, which is a small group of how many? Seventeen. Seventeen. Okay, wow, that is small. So four-ish per part? Approximately, yes. Okay. We move around a little bit. Okay. <laughs> and you all, was that a, just formed this year? We had a vocal ensemble last yes. year and the years before that was more of a formal choral arrangement type thing. And this year it's really bummed up to be more of a show choir where we can do more pop stuff and it's, it's, it's quite evolved from what it's been. Yes. And I have uh, heard you uh, a couple of times and it's very enjoyable. You all uh, do much outside the school day with it. Have you performed several places? Um, we we haven't really practiced. We have our own concerts separate from the choir department from Central, and um, we've had one last semester. And our upcoming one is in May third. We're having another one. And on May third at Sarah Barnhart Theater. Yes, ma'am. You all, what kind of show are you gonna give to our community? You guys want to talk about the theme? Me, you guys. Yeah. Okay. Um, it's kind of like it's diversified. We're not just doing contemporary music. We're gonna do a little bit of like the oldies, and then some contemporary for, to try to for folks like yeah. myself. Good <laughs> job. <laughs> I actually have a, a wide range of music appreciation, but I, I, there are a lot of people who really appreciate the oldies. Yes, ma'am. Yes, yeah. ma so that's very neat. Mm -hmm. And you all. Do you all help with uh, choreography? She's a choreographer. I'm the choreographer. <laughs> oh, way to go. Excellent. And how many, do you have an idea how many numbers y'all will be doing? Right now we have eight prepared. Okay. And it was about the same last semester too. Okay. So what else do you all, usually music, young pe people that are involved in music are also uh, involved. You're busy. Mm -hmm. And uh, do you take, any of you take private lessons or what else are you involved in? Let's start at the end. Um, through the school we have a voice teacher that comes to our class. Her name is Miss Pat May and she helps us out. Um, that's vocal, vocally. That's neat. Yes ma'am. Because you all, it's hard to go to uh, take lessons outside the school day. Mm -hmm. Wow. What else are you involved in? Um, I'm just involved in the Varsity Men's Choir and Vocal okay. Ensemble. Okay, so you really like music. Yes, I love music. Well, I do too, so I can appreciate that. Okay, um, what about you, Miss Alice? I uh, take a lot of dance classes and I do a lot with Saba. Yes. And um, also the theater department. I'm uh, the secretary of the board in the theater department. So I do quite a bit around. So music and drama. Yes. Yes. That's my favorite. Well, good for you. Okay. Keep going. Um, I'm also with Miss May in voice lessons. Um, and I'm also a varsity woman. And I'm doing state solo and ensemble. At, the state is next month that I'm practicing for. And. Um, I've recently been doing Taekwondo as well. 
<laughs> All right, there has to be a story behind that. <laughs> yes, ma'am. Well, I've <laughs> been doing sports my entire life, and I did soccer for a long time, and I'm a runner. And um, my brother, my little, he's he's about seven, and he's he did Taekwondo. And he'd always come home, and he'd always kick me and try and show me his new moves that he learned in class. So was this defense on yes, your part? Oh, yes, ma'am. <laughs> okay, well, that's probably, but that's a lifelong skill that can help you. Way yes, to go. Yes, ma'am. How cool is that? Okay, Caleb, what about you? I am a part of the men's choir, okay. and then I'm also in vocal ensemble. And then besides that, I'm not really in anything else but okay. National Honor Society. Okay. So. Outstanding. So that implies some service, community service, doesn't yes. it? Yes. You all are, your brain is wired uh, in a neat way, in a creative way, and I, there's a whole lot of research that te says that that helps a lot of people in other ways if you are, have participated in over several years in some type of music particularly. Um, there's a lot that says that helps strengthen you in the sciences, whether you end up that being your field of study or not. But I've had a lot of students where science, they were also good in science and or math. Is that the case with any of the four of y'all? Yes, ma'am. I'd say math and science isn't my strong point. <laughs> I'm an English and history person. Okay. <laughs> Well, that, that's good. We're glad you are. <laughs> you, what do you think will make, when people leave your May concert, will they be saying wow about? Probably all of our new dance moves. We have a lot of, we have a lot of dancing yes. in the next concert. <laughs> <laughs> Miss Alicia teaching us awesome moves. Yeah, we work pretty hard on the dancing because uh, we learn the music rather quickly so that we have time to work on the dancing and then putting it all together we like to spend a lot of time on so that you get the experience of and you get to start feeling what it's going to be like to actually be up there dancing and singing at the same time. And every song you do, you do some kind of choreography so that's a lot to learn. Yes. Well, there are a few songs that we don't dance to. I think there's going to be what, like two songs two? that we said? They're slower songs. Yeah. Okay, well, that still leaves a number of movements <laughs> yes. that yes. you have to learn so you don't look like the only one that didn't get it. Mm -hmm. And I'm sometimes in that category. <laughs> <laughs> so you think the dance uh, folks will leave, that will be one of their wows? Because you can have many wows, but yep. one of their wows? Yes, ma'am. Do you have... Um, are you doing anything with the stage as far as sets or your costuming to add to your performance? Um, there are two songs that we're going to do costumes for that are separate from our um, uniform dresses and tuxes for the guys. Um, and we have yeah. a theme this year and it's going to be a family is fighting over the radio on a, in a car trip and so that's how you'll see our different uh, types of songs playing throughout and so you'll get to see that progress throughout the show. Well that's clever. <laughs> Way to go. So you are you to the point you're saying I'm enjoying this? Very much. Oh, yes, yes. Yes. Very yes. much. Mm -hmm. How cool! <laughs> because what a shame to spend a lot of time on something by choice. I mean, no one made you. It isn't a math assignment or a science project. Mm -hmm. You chose to do this, and it would be yucky if you were going, well, not yet. We're not quite there. Yeah. Yeah. And would you say that's true of all the, those in the group? I'd say we're all very dedicated. We really want it to be the best it can be because we love being together as a group and getting to work on this stuff that's a whole lot different than what we usually do. Well, how mm -hmm. neat. And even for you who are do, participating in other groups in our city for the theater, so you would certainly recognize when kids are not working together as a unit. Oh, yes. And the audience senses that, don't you think? Yes. Mm -hmm. I agree with that, mm -hmm. and it means it's not quite as sharp. So you... Uh, I, uh, tell us the time and uh, the cost of the tickets. 
Okay, our concert will be uh, May 3rd at 7.30, and the admission is free. You're kidding! That's the best deal in town! Yes, ma'am. Are you accepting donations or any such? I'm sure we will. <laughs> Absolutely you should. That's a great thing. I think this uh, there's a large audience in this town who appreciates good performance. And so people will be delighted to have... What night of the week is that? It's a Friday night. Okay, nice. So is there anything else that you all are proud about what you're in your music department you've done? We just recently had a UIL competition and our mixed choir, we made a one on stage and a two in sight reading. And the one's the top score for, yes, ma'am. for our audience. Superior is one and two is excellent. And then Varsity Woman, we made um, sweepstakes, which is one in both sight reading and concert. Yep. As good as it gets. <laughs> yes, ma'am. Wow. Excellent. I'm proud of y'all. <laughs> and so, a lo- and didn't a good group make it then on to state? Yes, we had quite a few people that participated at our uh, solo and ensemble here in town that get to advance to state. Okay. 25. Yeah, it was over 20 people. Yes. Nice, 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 nice. Because that is, uh, anybody in the state who's ever had young people would recognize that as quite an honor. That's not just because you're a a nice young man that you get that. (laughs) You had to earn it. Mm -hmm. Outstanding. Well, I'm really proud of y'all, as I know Mr. Waters is, and your conductor. Tell tell us about, uh, you seniors have been in the music department at Central for a while, and talk, talk to me a little bit about your conductor, who is uh, a new, relatively new, mm-hmm. and what he's brought this uh, show choir. That has been a, a nice change. What else would you like? do you think he has brought to Central? He's certainly putting his thumbprint in a good way. Yes, ma'am. He, um, he helps us come together as a family, so we work together. And if, if we all work together, then we, we have good results. Yeah. And he's really good at doing that. Yeah, and good conductors have to be strict. And he is, but when I have observed, it's a pleasure to see he also enjoys young people and enjoys doing what he's mm-hmm. doing. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. So uh, I feel very grateful for what he's doing with you all. Well, y'all are a delight. You make me so proud. <laughs> so uh, I hope our uh, city will come and support you as I know your families will. Way Thank to you. go, young people. <laughs> Thank, Thank you. you. To our almost graduates and our next year's in charge. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Thank you.